Dootley versus Video Scribe versus Toonly. In this video, I'm going to compare these three softwares so that you can find out which one is the best for you. I'm going to compare pricing, features, and how easy it is to work with these softwares so that you can find out which one you would like to go with. Before that, I do want to mention that I'm not getting paid to say this and I won't leave any affiliate links in the description down below. So this is my honest opinion. Let's find out which one is the best. Let's get started with Dootly. So Dootly is a whiteboard animation software. If we go to the homepage and I click on play, you can see what this kind of looks like and what this can do for you. So you can see that it's a pretty cool um, whiteboard animator that's going to create engaging videos. Now, if I simply scroll down all the way, I want to uh, show you some samples so that you can get a good understanding of what this software can do for you. So if you simply scroll down, you'll find a few samples. Now let's say that I click right there, it's gonna start playing the video. So this is a great example of what this software can make for you. So this is just a random glass board, uh, glass board animation video. So you can see there's a huge difference between them because this is a whiteboard animation and this is a glass board. So it's kind of made, um, it, it seems like it's glass and the person is drawing on it from behind, if that makes sense. But you can see that the results from this are pretty cool. This is very engaging and the quality and the actual drawing is pretty cool as well. Now, if we compare that to the whiteboard animation, you can see that it's slightly different because the uh, hand is in front of the actual drawing. Um, but you can also see that the quality is great. It's engaging and it's actually creating a cool um, whiteboard animation. Children are a gift, which is pretty cool. Now, if I scroll down even further, we've got a blackboard, which is pretty similar to this, but then instead of whiteboard animation, it's a blackboard. Um, and once again, looks pretty similar, pretty cool. If I just skip through, we'll see some of the results. Uncle David is always busy. So this is a great way to um, like kind of make a story visual. So this is great for storytelling. Now we've also got a glass board right there. We've got another glass board, blackboard, and we've got whiteboards. So these are just different samples, but do know that those are free features that are available. Let me just pause this, there we go. Now if I go all the way back, to the website, you can see that they don't have any, well, they do have any, my bad. They do have a free trial. So if you click on try Dootly right there, they will send you over to this, where if you scroll down, you can simply get going. However, is there actually a free trial? It doesn't seem like it, right? They say um, like try it, but then right there, you won't see any free trials. However, these are the features which I'll get into in a bit. Now let's take a look at VideoScribe. And what I like about VideoScribe is that they do offer free trials. So as you can see right there, VideoScribe is easy, quick, and, and inexpensive. You can create videos in no time. Free trial. So if you click on that, let me open that in a new window, you can actually just sign up for an account and you can then download the file. So if you click right there, download, you can go ahead and download that specific software. So if you click right there, you're going to download and install it, which is pretty cool because the others don't offer that. But if I scroll down and click right there, I'll show you a simple example of what this will get you. So if I just click play, you'll see that this is very similar. It's a whiteboard animation with some colors, which is great. However, the quality is pretty decent. However, in my opinion, as you can see right there, the difference between those, but the videos that I just showed you a few minutes ago were higher quality in my opinion. However, you can see the colors are pretty decent, pretty bright. So that's good stuff. However, if I just simply click on a few other ones, I'll also show you some more classical um, whiteboard animations. There we go. This one, however, this one is great. So if I simply skip through, you can see that this is good. It's high quality and it's a great way once again to do storytelling. As you can see, pretty engaging, pretty cool, right? Now, what I like about this over Dootly is that they have a free trial. So if you're not sure what you would like to go with it, you can simply use the free trial and find out if it's something for you. Now, if I go to Toonly, which is the only self software left, once again, I don't see any free trials. If I simply scroll down, once again, you'll notice that the layout, the software, the websites are very similar to Dootly. Take a look at this. And so this is Dootly. And this is Toonly. So it's probably the same company behind the software um, or <laughs> behind the, 
the website, the sales page. However, it does look pretty similar. By Brixen, by Brixen. There we go. So it's the similar. Uh, it's the same company that's making these softwares in this case. But right there, you can uh, see all the features. Now, if I simply click right there, I would like to show you what Toonly can do for you. So it's kind of different than whiteboard animations, as you can see. So if I simply click on this video, I'm going to show you a simple example of what this can do for you. So this is more like the animation style, which once again is really engaging. You can see this is so cool. Like honestly, I would watch this over the whiteboard animations all the time, in my opinion. But yeah, that's just my personal opinion. But anyway, this is what this can actually do for you. It can create good animations that are engaging, high quality. And if I just skip through a few others, you also see what they look like. So this doesn't look great, but this does indeed look pretty good. And this right there is also great. So you can get characters to talk as well, which I'll get into in a bit. But yeah, that's just the, the three different softwares on their own. So that's what they can do for you. But let's get into the features of all of them. So if I go to features on Dootly, let me, uh, I'm already there. Features on Video Scribe, let's see. Then we've got the features for Video Scribe and Toonly. So if I scroll down, let's start comparing them. So for um, Dootly, which is the whiteboard or the simply like the board animation software, for 39 bucks per month, you can create unlimited videos. You've got, uh, you can use them on multiple computers, which is great. Premium support, 803 character images. That's really important. You can see the main difference between the enterprise and the standard are the amount of characters that you will get access to. So you can see that on the cheaper option, you'll get 803. On the more expensive one, it's 3,596. So that's way better because you'll just get more content, to be honest. Right there, 1,157 and 3,000 plus. 84 scenes, so that's the same. The royalty tracks are 50 more, but that's not a main feature because you can download them yourself as well from YouTube or other sources. So I wouldn't pay attention to that. However, you can see access to Dootly Club monthly mentor, uh, membership. Right there, you can get new characters and images. Now, honestly, you don't really need that because it's not the main feature, but they just do that to draw you in. Um, but it's going to cost you more money. So the main difference between the two, if you want more characters to make more content, definitely go with the more expensive option. However, this is going to get you a great software too, especially when you're just starting out. So I would recommend simply going with this one first and then upgrading if you want to. For Video Scribe, you can see that the plans are kind of different. They've got a uh, yearly plan, a monthly plan, and a one-off plan. So if you simply want to use this, you want to pay it up front to use it forever, it's going to cost you 550 euros. So you can buy that right away. You can do a yearly plan, which is going to do um, 13 euros per month on average, 156 paid yearly, it's a recurring payment, and then monthly 25. Now if I scroll down, I'll show you the features. So right there. So these come with quick start video templates, a free library of over 7,300 images. You can use your own assets and video scribe will draw them. So that's something that I really like is what you can do is simply put in a picture or just a vector or whatever, a design, and then video scribe will actually draw that um, with their software. So with their animation stuff, which is really cool. That's a cool feature. Now you can record a voiceover with this, so let's say that you're making YouTube videos out of these, what you can do is simply add a voiceover so that the video um, gets more context and it's engaging, which is great for YouTube um, or videos in general, to be honest. Now, if you scroll down even further, what you cannot do is buy premium images and you cannot remove the video scribe watermark, which is the reason why you should definitely go with the pay plan in the first place because watermarks are annoying, no one likes them. Now, what you can also do with the pay plans is that you can add your own logo watermark, which is cool as well, so that no one can rip off your own content. Let's say you're making content, you're making these videos, but you're not um, adding any watermarks, then someone can just simply steal that and then they can just use it, right? Um, but apart from that, there are not that many features on here, um, but you can always get started with the seven day free trial and then see which one you need. Now, if we uh, move to Toonly, the last um, software, you can see that the characters on here are very different as well. So remember, this is the more animation style software, not the whiteboards. But on here, with the standard plan, you'll get 30 characters, the enterprise 82, 
17 uh, character animations and 30, 1000, 2000, 71, 139, 10, 20, 21, 100. So you can see the main difference in here is not really that the software is going to be different, but it's just that you're going to get access to less characters or less content in the first place so that you would need to upgrade to the 70 per month plan. However, if you're going to decide to buy um, Dootly or Toonly, you can just go with the cheaper version at first and then if you like it, you can always upgrade to the more expensive plan and pay more per month, but then also get more content. So those are pretty much the software that I wanted to show you. In my opinion, if you want a more animation style, definitely go with Toonly because they've got these characters and more engaging videos. If you want whiteboard animations, definitely go with Dootly because um, Videoscribe, in my opinion, it's a bit less, like the quality is a bit less. Um, however, it's still decent software and you can get a free trial, which is always good because then you can find out whether you like it or not. But that's pretty much my comparison between Dootly, Videoscribe and Toonly. So like, uh, like I just said, if you're going to go with whiteboard or just animations, board animations, go with Dootly. More animated stuff, definitely go with Toonly. If you're on a budget, you can try the Videoscribe free trial, see if that's a good fit and then upgrade as well because it's cheaper. But yeah, that's pretty much my personal opinion. Um, if you appreciate this video, make sure you go ahead and leave a like. I would appreciate that. That would also help this video reach more people so that they can make a better decision too. Now, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments below and then I'll see you in the next one. Have a good day.